I want to give all honors and praises to Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, Bahashim Rakakadash, and uh, double honors to the apostles and elders and great millstone who rule well and who taught me this truth. Uh, and enough respect and salutations out there to the brothers uh, and the Akim out there doing the work in sincerity and in truth. And um, I'm just here, you know, just rolling in the spirit, uh, just to make this not even a lesson, but just you know, this is maybe a, a uh, just a little quick exhortation, you know, for the uh, Akim out there. That's that's really being sincere, and for the brothers who are, I guess, going off a little bit. Because um, earlier I, I seen a video with a Apostle Tahar, and he was saying that you know you shouldn't be a member of of Great Millstone if you're not really fervent, if you're not really taking action in 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 in, in um, making videos, doing lessons, uh, uh, being brotherly, just just going to camp. That's mostly what uh, he was going into the video saying that if certain brothers, a couple of brothers got suspended because, you know, they weren't doing the will of the Most High. They wasn't being fervent. They wasn't being diligent enough. So, therefore, you know, certain uh, repercussions had to happen and, you know, I guess a couple of brothers got suspended. Um... I'm not a part of GMS, but I follow Great Millstone. I go out to the camp and I, I you know, I try to do everything that I can until eventually, you know, Apostle Tahar will eventually let me, you know, come through. Um, so when I see that, you know, you know, I guess the spirit may leave certain brothers and, and their brothers just not being diligent or they're just really not the men of the Lord. I put up at least three videos a, uh, a a week, and I'm seeing I'm like, well, what's 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 going on with these brothers? How come they're not being diligent? Like, did the spirit lead them, or like what what like what is really going on? Did they let Satan get a hold of them? Did they did they fall back into the world? Because we already know that this 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 world is gonna pass away. All the works they're in is gonna burn up. It's all gonna be gone. So you know, I, I, I you know, I, I made a poem. I, I, I try to do at least. Um, I just started this within, I believe, it's like a week ago. I want to start doing at least one a week. You know, just to put one on the page. You know, maybe a brother can look at it and be like, "Well, damn," you know, uh, it it may spark something in his spirit to kind of stay on fire. So uh, the poem is called uh, Fire in My Soul. Uh, this is something that's quick. Um, I just made it up like five minutes ago. Um, hopefully uh, the Occam can like it. You know, you know, you can share it around. But it's called Fire in My Soul. And this is uh, basically it's pertaining to me as well. Uh, hopefully it can pertain to another brother that that is out there. Um, Salakia. And it reads on. Let's just let's just go ahead and jump into it. And it reads on. As a fire that is kindled through my soul. My eyes bulge out as a red eyed tree frog. My spirit seeketh all around my surroundings. In this world of a place called darkness. My spirit sparks up so much light. It is loud. Strong barkings, as loud as a dog. That fire that's in my soul, happiness with wrath, burns my spirit up like coals. Always on fire, fire, fire. As I go walking, as I go talking, setting up on the streets, prophesying the name of my father, Yahweh. It's never been a day that I go without thinking about my power. He has awakened me with great strength, powerful knowledge, and wisdom of his being. I am the watchman in which he sets upon his tower. I call forth, I scream, and blow the trumpets. My people are so gone. They've drunken to where they have no third eye. 
my spirit is vexed as I prophesy upon the tower. That great fire that's in my soul will never go out of power. For my father, Yahweh, Bahashim Yahweh Shai. And it reads, you know, uh, that's my name, brother, uh, Malakaya. And uh, that is the fire that is in my soul. I have a fire that is in my soul that I have to, that I continually read, I study, I look at the videos. I'm, I'm, I'm being very diligent because I really want to be a part. I really want to please the Most High. Very humble brother. Very uh, spiritual. Love to go into deep things. So hopefully the brothers that can see, they need to stay on fire. Have that. Have your soul barking as loud as a dog. Stay on fire. Don't 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 let the fire be kindled out with water or anything else. Stay on fire. Always stay on fire. Stay diligent. Stay stay diligent to make your election and calling uh to make your uh calling and election sure. It's too late in the game right now for us to uh give up. You know, we in the time of the rumors of wars. You know, you see the prophecy. We can see the mark of the beast is being implemented all across the world right now. Different things. It's, the Esau is starting to tighten up right now. And this is not the time to fall off and go on to the wayside. But if the, if, if, if the, uh, if the brothers that go on to the wayside, those truly were not the men of the Lord. So hopefully this could be a little edifying, a little quick video that I've done. I, um, yeah, that's, I mean, I, I hope it's a little edifying. I, I mean, I really have no more to say. Um, just like to give another double honors to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone uh, who taught me this truth. Uh, enough uh, respect and salutations out there to the Akim doing the work in sincerity and truth. This is Brother Ma uh, Malakaya. Uh, Shalom.